Hey guys, welcome to another lesson of Pro Teachers Noob. Today I have with me Eric. Hello again. And as a follow up to our Marvel Knights Spider Man and me doing the um, Wolverine Enemy of the State with our mutual friend Dan, it makes sense to now jump into Old Man Logan. Now, have you heard of this at all? A uh, couple times. Yep. I uh, just let you know this is nothing like the um, the movie Logan. Uh, right. Uh, and the only thing that's like it is that Wolverine's older and it's set years in the future. With bloody claws and guys that look like they're a cross between uh, Mad Max and uh, Old Snake. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. So, yeah, first of all, let's just look at that cover. Just look at that. That gets you wanting to read the story. <laughs> it does. But if you notice, both the Spider Man and the Wolverine the State both had similar gatefold covers. Oh. Yeah, you're oh, back. I, oh, I, doubt, I just realized now the skull is of Cap. I didn't notice a big A on there. Now, I should point this out that this yeah. goes along with the um, Bucky Cap, and we assume that Steve Cap never came back. Oh. I just want to make that clear ahead of time. Oh, and uh, you see that T-Rex? Look at the black stuff around him. It's Venom. Venom on a T-Rex. No, thanks. Spidey, are, Spidey could take down a T-Rex, but a Venom T-Rex? Oh, and uh, the, the Hulk, Hulk gang. I noticed. Let's dive in. And, flame, yeah. and flaming arrows. Oh, my God, it's Rambo. <laughs> and where do you find out who this old guy is? Okay. Nobody, and, and no, no, nobody knows what uh, happened on the night the heroes fell. All we know is that they disappeared and evil triumphed, and the bad guys have been calling the shots ever since. What happened to Wolverine is the biggest mystery of all. Some say they hurt him like no one ever was ever hurt before. Others say he just grew tired of all the fighting and retired to a simpler what life. Either way, he hasn't raised his voice or popped his claws in close to 50 years. His old friends would barely recognize him now. <laughs> this is clearly a Western base, obviously. <whistles> oh, gee, just look at that. Oh, but Wolverine, like, he's at a rail track. Pa? Tractor's broke down again, Pa. Trying my best to patch it up, but I reckon we need a brand new engine. Well, unless you got some magic beans to sell. I don't know how we're <laughs> going to get one, Scotty. So what do we do? Some heavy lifting, I guess. Abe Donovan said he wouldn't give me 20 bucks for the pigs. Told him they were clean, but he just wouldn't take the risk after last time. Can't say I blame him. How many did he lose? 500? What are we going to do, Logan? I'll think of something. Jolly from the market offered 38 bucks for the Xbox. Said she'd make it an even 40 if we threw in that lifelong battery. We're not selling the children's toys, Marine. <laughs> Just an idea is all. Rent's due in two days' time, and we got nothing else worth selling. Besides, the kids know how tight things are. They don't mind, Pa. We, uh, we hardly got time to play with it anyway. I'm not selling my children's toys. My friend Becky's mom was saying you used to be a superhero. She said you were in some kind of team before the bad guys took over. Is that true, Pa? You tell Becky's mom there's no such thing as superheroes. Now be a good girl and pass me those um, bread rolls. Can I you say know, he, look, he looks kind of like Ron Perlman in Sons of Anarchy. He does. You know yeah. Jay didn't mean no harm. Only natural, only natural child would be curious about what her father used to do. Don't be angry with her, Logan. She's just a little girl. It's not the baby I'm angry with. It's myself. Oh, well, someone else is new. <laughs> <laughs> How could I let things get this bad? You know what they do when you don't make rent. You heard what happened to the family over the ridge, but they missed payments three months in a row. This is our first time in over 20 years. Doesn't matter. They don't look and they don't, they can't look weak in front of doom and the kingpin and all the other landlords. They have to punish people. Just tell them they'll get double next month, Logan. They'll understand. I'm sure they can be reasonable when they want to be. These are Bruce Brent and Banner's grandchildren's Marine. They don't do reasonable. Ugh. Put the gun away, boy. It's okay, Pa. Nobody'll see it. It'll just keep it close in case those goons give us and give us trouble. Only way that'll happen if they see your damn gun. It's only trying to help for fur's sake. And watch your <laughs> language, boy. You stop that cussing. You hear me, Logan? The Hulk gang's here. 
and look what they're using. No, not the Fantastic Mobile. <laughs> Banner. They turned it into an old Jeep. <laughs> uh, Wolverine. Oh, oh, excuse me. I keep forgetting you don't like people calling you by your old name. Um, is it Mr. Wolverine you go by these days? Logan Spine. That's right. Wolverine died the night the bad guys beat your asses. How forgetful of me. Oof. Now, we'll cut to the chase here, Logan, because we know you don't have this month's rent, which is why my brothers are here, too. You met Otis and Charles once or twice. Well, you being such a badass all these years ago, they were worried this might turn nasty. Of course, I tried to explain you were a pacifist now, but you know what brothers are like. Are you ready to take your punishment, Runt? Or do we got to flatten your crappy little farm? You deaf, old man? And are you t and are you ready to take your beating? This punk trying to piss us off? Ah, the claws. Shrink, Logan! Oh, oh, oh geez. Well, now he was just thinking it. That's oh. all that was, was him thinking it. Ah, uh, double G's, though. Ugh. Yep. Uh, yeah, yes, I'm ready to take my beating. Good! Oh, Wolverine, how the hell did they mess you up so bad you won't even defend yourself? Come on, Bunk, you used to be the most dangerous man alive. We're just a bunch of hillbillies. And get your hands off my paw. He's funny. Just glad we got a sense of humor, little man. Double next month or everybody dies. You forgot the click clack. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you're right. Oh, it doesn't even look too bad to me. That's because you're blind, Hawkeye. Hawkeye. Yep, even so, your feeling factors might not be what it used to be, but it still knows how to piece it back together. That said, a puncture lung is still in the, the least of your worries if you don't find their money soon. You got any little nest eggs tucked away? What do you think? I think you're in a lot of trouble. The only question is what you're willing to do about it. If you're talking about fighting, I ain't interested. I will never raise my fist again. Oh, I know, I know. They kicked our butts when and these were and when there were hundreds of us. What chance would we they, we have against them now? My days of fighting supervillains are long behind me too, Logan. This is more of a business proposition. What kind of business proposition? A delivery job. Is it legal? You'd ask an old adventure if he'd ever break the law. <laughs> I need to get a package to the East Coast inside two weeks, but driving there myself is impossible. I need a navigator, and I'm willing to pay you $500 for your trouble. That's an awful lot of dough, Wolverine, and an awful lot of rent. What do you say? My name is Logan. Sure it is. <laughs> you sure you want to go through with this, honey? New Babylon's hardly the nicest place. Never mind what you'll face getting there. What choice do we have? Besides, just a couple of weeks each way, and it sets, up, and sets us up for a long, long time. Scotty? I want you to look after your mother and sister now, here. Jay, I want you to promise you'll behave. I promise. Love you, baby girl. Love you too, Pa. Oh, please, if Sabretooth could see you now. <laughs> oh, look! Nice fan. No, Wait, Spidey? At, what the hell are you doing in that, in, in the driver's seat, you old fool? It's my car, ain't it? Your job is to read the map and nudge my arm if you spot any potholes. This really the spider mobile? Built by Johnny Storm himself and customized, of course, by me and one of my ex-wives. Now fasten your safety belt, my muty friend. This mule's got a hell of a kick. Vroom! It's fat. It has to be if we're going to cross the four main kingdom. Now turn on the sat nap and tell me if we're driving in the right direction. Hulkland, Hulkland formerly the abomination would... territory. The kingdom formerly of the, the domain of Agneto. <laughs> yep. And we're um, it's an open to area. Doom's lair. <sighs> Uh, Osborne City, the oh. president's quarters. One mile down, 3,000 to go. Awesome. The Lizard King. The Lizard King. <laughs> yep, among other things. Marling, San Antonio. So. Yep, get ready for the ride of your life. So how is that for the start? I mean, it's, I mean, it sets everything up. I'll give it that. Not that, but the, oh, what did they do? They're the cars. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the spider will be a what better thing to drive in, right? <laughs> <laughs> tell that to uh, tell that to Peter. This is where the hero spell. Logan and Hawkeye, the massacre of the superheroes. I can't look. <laughs> so yeah, so far they're um oh and get directions to hear from search. <laughs> Dedicated to the memory of Michael Turner. Oh yeah, he had passed away about around pretty well around that point. 
Oh. He ain't keeping, and we ain't exactly keeping a low profile here, Hawkeye. Good. The Spidey Buggy loves attention. Besides, I got Wolverine as my wingman. Who the hell is going to mess with us? I already told you. I ain't that guy no more. Yeah, well, let's just say I don't think you're as harmless as all those idiots think you are. You couldn't be more wrong. The animal's still in there, Logan. I can smell it. Hawkeye, look out! We're heading for a cliff. Would you relax? And, oh God, I just got a thumb on the least flashbacks. <laughs> it's the Spidey Buggy, dude. She could take her chair of Knox. Okay. <laughs> this cargo we're moving out to New Babylon. I gotta ask, is it drugs you got back there? Don't ask me stuff like the, that, man. Please. I don't need reminding how far I've fallen. Oh, no. What's up? According to the sat-nav, we're already in San Francisco, but there's nothing around for miles. Wouldn't be the first thing not, not to work in here. No, it's working fine. We're right in the heart of, of Union Square and facing on the Market Street. What the hell's going on? Moloids. What? The underground race the mole man found. Little yellow guys who go blind in the, in the light. Some folks reckon they're the planet's immune system. They were resting down there for millions of years. But the moment our number hit 8 billion people, the planet released them to send us all out. Uh, I've, I've heard they've been feeding in Europe and Asia. This is the first time I've seen in America. They can sink entire cities. In an right American attack, it says. American attack. Yeah. Sorry. Right beneath the ground. And right beneath the ground. Wow. What are you doing? And what are you doing? Just checking to see if there are any survivors. Must have been a whole lot of people living here before this. Smell anything? All dead. Just what we needed. More stuff to worry about. Thank God I've got my big bad Wolverine for protection. The name's Logan, oh, old guy. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot. You're just a simple farmer helping me out for some rent money, right? All right. The wife and kids are back in Sacramento, man. You don't need to pretend anymore. What the hell? Ghost, Ghost Riders. Riders. They look like giant uh, um, uh, fidget spinner wheel the wheels when they're lit on fire. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Keep him away from the buggy, man. Don't let him and touch the cargo. I don't think he's listening, old timer. What's the matter, pig? Stand up. Fight back. What the hell's wrong with you, man? I will never hurt another living soul. You can do what you like to me, boy, but I refuse to strike you back. Well, that's pretty stupid. Uh, now, let's see what like they've the got in here. It's drugs, man. The, bl and the blind guy's a courier. I heard about some shipment on his way out. And I, oh, that's, that's right, bitches. Just keep making noises. Hawkeye, what have you done? Oh, don't you start. I'm pissed off with you as it is. <laughs> uh, uh, you've taken an oath not to pop your claws. All of a sudden, you're the beautiful pacifist. I've been telling you this since we left Sacramento. Yeah, but I didn't think you meant it. What the hell did they do to you, man? They come. Only reason I'm still alive. But yeah, so they're driving through. Now they're in Vegas now. Hammer Falls. Yep, just up ahead is where the Absorbing Man and Magneto finished off our great white hope. Mm. You've never been this far before. Not in 50 years. This is where they come to pray that the superheroes come back. You know, like the old days when they just rise from the dead with some cool new costumes. Oh, God. <laughs> Ain't gonna happen. Don't I know it. But no point telling them that, dude. The human spirit dies without a hope in their coffee. Who's in charge of this place? Does Nevada fall under banners jurisdiction? Nah, the kingpin's the landlord around these parts, man. The Hulk's just got California. What's with all the trinkets and statues? I doubt the president would be happy to see all this superhero memorabilia. Hey, he turns a blind eye when there's money to be made. Hammer Falls is the number one tourist attraction in America. Jesus. <gasps> Tell me about it. They're praying Not the, to it. Not the hammer. Uh, look, Ultron! The hell? Hawkeye, thank goodness you're here. It's me, Ultron 8. Did you get the message from Tanya? Excuse me? You didn't get the message? No, we're just passing through, Ultron. My friend and I are heading for New Babylon, and man. We're only stopped here for a Coke and some fries. Incredible. This truly is the town where miracles happen. Come on, Tanya's over in the garage. Who's, who's Tanya? Ex-wife's number three. I never tell you about this one. She's Peter's youngest daughter. Really great sense of humor. <laughs> and she's black. I should point that out. Yeah. Uh, well, it's only a matter of time, wasn't it? Filling her head with all your nonsense. 
excuse me, Ashley and her friends formed a superhero team and Clint and they said they like and they didn't like the way Kingpin ran this place and they were heading north to take the big man down. All three of them got captured, boy and boys, they say I'm um, boys, they say he plans to execute them first thing in the morning. Couldn't you tell her your drug dealer stories? At least that way she'd be earning a living. I don't understand. Who are we even talking about here? She's talking about Ashley, man. Our daughter. I've seen a picture of that before. Spider bitch. <laughs> That's her name. Uh, you don't get a strike for saying the B word, right? Nope. Uh, just checking. Wait, how many issues is this? Uh, seven. Got it. So we're going. We're making a good pace. Uh, yeah. This is a decom. Uh, this comic really probably should have been. Uh, well, given how the there's so much open because... land, there's a lot of time to skip from the driving. No, I know that. I'm just saying. Duh, say, I'm just saying it is reason by this feels decompressed if it wasn't you know collected all in one. Right. Exactly. Yeah, but but then again, the last issue is a double sized or giant sized annual a book. Ah, gotcha. And to be and to be honest, never really had Ashley pegged at the superhero type. That's because you walked away when she was three months old, Hawkeye. Ultron at eight is the only father she ever really knew. Tanya, please don't start any trouble. And besides, what are you talking about? Her grandfather was Spider-Man and her dad was an Avenger. Being a superhero is hardwired into her DNA. Even so, she always struck me as more of an evil badass type. She never really seemed especially altruistic. Excuse me, but are we even having this conversation? Our daughter's about to be executed by the kingpin here. Are you just gonna help are you gonna help her or is she just gonna die? Of course we're gonna help her. I'm not complete, dirtbag. Speak for yourself. <laughs> and what? I got hired as your map reader, pub. I ain't getting dragged into one of your stupid adventures. Are you kidding me? My daughter's going to die and you're arguing about the contract? The deal was I helped you get the new Babylon. I ain't going up against the kingpin. Bad enough you got me running drugs for you, jackass. I'll pay you double. What? You need to clear your debt with the Hulk gang, right? You help me save my daughter, and I'll double your money. I still ain't fighting. All I'm asking is you read the freaking ma 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 map, Logan. And that's it. Scout's honor. Okay, it's a deal. But just so we're clear, I'd rather die than pop these claws again. You understand? I reckon I can fight my own battles. Now, come on. We can't waste any more time here. The King's Pen lives in Salt Lake City, and it's already a 12-hour drive. Mr. Logan, for luck, sir. Oh, again, further showing the flashbacks. Come on, dude. Charlie Xavier was faster on his feet. <laughs> I beg your pardon? <laughs> <laughs> I know this country was tired as it is, but Salt Lake City is still on the way and i swear this won't take long you have my word i'll have you back in time to pay your landlords logan we're both in this for our kids now hawkeye we're only doing what we have to i still can't believe she's actually out there calling herself a superhero i mean i know it's insane in the current climate but man i gotta be honest with you i'm so freaking proud what the hell is this what's wrong according to the map we're in cedar city but all I'm seeing is miles of nothing and a big church pile sticking out of the ground. You okay up there, Bob? Bob, I said, are you okay? Moloids, they swallowed the whole town. I climbed and climbed to the highest point, but everybody else, they just went under. Mm -hmm. We can do in here, man. But, but, come on. Ashley needs it more than he does. Oh, man. Lord. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to meet Daredevil and the Punisher. Yeah. These three superheroes who wa and waltz into town to save everyone from the kingpin of crime. That's me, incidentally. I'm f and I could, I, he's taking the name. This is not uh, Fisk. He looks like that. He looks like he almost reminds me of Notorious B.I.G. or one of those other rappers. There's if they took over. Unfortunately, what these boys seem to forget is that they were going after one of the most evil badasses in all creation. I'm the man who killed Magneto, after all. You remember know, Magneto? He got this place after that superhero holocaust he engineered with Dr. Doom and the president and all the other bigwigs. But the big man made one stupid mistake, boys and girls. Bitch got old. Please, just tell us what you've done with Ashley. Your skinny ringleader? Well, let's just say I'm still thinking up something nasty. You guys got off light. Yeah. You call that light? 
Now, I don't know if this is actually Matt and Frank or people taking up their mantle. It's hard to tell, but it doesn't yeah. matter. Yeah. Come on. Can, can't believe those punks came after you like that. Little and um, blood lead and heels and heels. I, uh, yeah, I. They got a now little now blood leaden's healthy every now and then, boys. Uh, blood leaden's healthy every now and then. Sorry. Just to remind everyone who's top dog. Kimpin's who top out. dog is? Who top dog, who top is. dog is? Sorry. You, you want me to read this? <laughs> no, no, it's fine. Kimpin's okay, coming okay. out of the stadium. Now, and now I'm getting a rock star reception down there. What's the matter with these gut clowns? The guy's a psychopath. Just shows how bad things were under Magneto. Kingpin's a street fighter, a man of the people. He worked his way up from nothing, and folks respect that. Plus, he keeps them entertained. Anything on Ashley? Locked up in that customized Walmart across the street. Security's tight. Maybe 50 bodies from the ground to the roof. Each one armed to the teeth. It ain't gonna be easy, Hawkeye. Good. I And, and good thing I got my genius plan. Just make sure I, it don't involve me. I already told you. I will not be a party to violence here. Relax, Powder Puff. All you got to do is oh, drive. Oh, powder Puff. <laughs> I don't get what why you're, and what you're so angry about anyway. You don't like living here. You should and you should try to a week in Doom's quarters. Kingpin's looks after us, Spider Bitch. All he asks in return is a little loyalty. I guess it must be in your blood. Your dad being Hawkeye and your grandf grandfather being Peter Parker. But what the hell were you thinking, huh? That it, you, and that you and your friends were going to save everybody? And, and faster. We need to hit at least 200. And this this is your genius plan of yours? It wouldn't ju be ju just be smashing through the walls and killing everybody, would it? Yep. <laughs> that ain't genius. It is if it works. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That'll be dad. You're on your own here, bub. Like I said, I'm not taking part in that stupid freaking fight. Relax, I can handle these punks, especially when they keep yelling and giving away their position. <laughs> oh, Ashley, uh, where's the control panel? 30 inches and 31 inches to the left of my voice. Gotcha. Chink, chink. Jesus, this is violent. What the hell's going on here? You just made your first big mistake, Kingpin. You got old. Oh, oh, oh. That's it. Did you read this without throwing up? <gasps> That's it. Messy as it sounds. Worse. Ugh. Ashley, what are you doing? What I came here to do. Seize control of the Kingpin's quarter. I thought you came here to free everybody. That's because you're stupid, Dad. I killed the Kingpin like he killed Magneto. Now it's time to show these boys what their new boss is made of. Damn you to hell for making me do this, Hawkeye. Uh -oh. So yeah, she wasn't altruistic. Nope. Apparently not. Jeez. Seriously, how did you read this without throwing up? This is this is a bloody mess. I've seen worse. Really? Yeah, take name one book that was about worse than this, bloody wise. Um, in Infinite Crisis, Black Adam pushed um, Psycho Pirates Golden Mask. That says, space. I mean, throughout the entire story. Oh. Mm, I'd have to get back to you on that one. Oh, wait, duh, Walking Dead. Dad, okay, that's not a zombie story. Regular superheroes. Okay, I'd have to think on that one, dude. All right, all right. I'm just asking because, man, this man this turned into Mortal Kombat way too quick. Right. <laughs> you don't have you don't have to do this, Ashley. I don't have to do anything, Dad. I'm doing it because I want to. What the hell, Logan? Boom! Jesus wept. You okay? No. Just get get inside and keep your head down, all guy. Stop. Stop, stop, stop! Whoa! Jesus, Logan! Nice kid you got there. Just shut up and drive, huh? Jeez. What are you doing standing around? Get after them! Spider Bitch is a fitting name for her, isn't it? Uh, yeah. I no longer like her. <laughs> I, I don't believe this. What's wrong? There, there must be 50 cars on her tail, and they're gaining fast. I don't... I think there's guys on dinosaurs, too. Where the hell do they get dinosaurs? Savage I was about to imports. say there's a I was about to say there's a couple of dinosaurs too. <laughs> Savage Land Imports, Midwest covered in um oh god, you feel that rumbling? They must be right beneath behind us. That ain't them. It's an earthquake. Holy burp! Strap yourself <laughs> in, quick. Two hours pass. Living in the land of the lost. Sorry, oh, that just came in my mind as I went I, down. <laughs> I think we just got mugged by the Moloids. They're the ones who do this stuff, right? How long was I out? 
feels like I popped a couple of joints, but I don't remember nothing. You okay, bub? Don't worry, that's not Hawkeye. That's the other guys. Ugh. Mother of God. Get that and go to hell, you sons of furps! Logan, it's okay. I'm over here. What? Use your light stick. It blinds them. Their eyes are so used to the dark, they can't see a thing in the light. They've been scratching the car for hours, trying to get in. I heard those people screaming, man. What's been happening? Easy, bub. I got your back. Just take it easy in there. Everything's going to be fine. Wait, and what? What's that noise? Get, and get your ass out of here, you little freak. Okay, now I'm going to turn on the headlight. But I got to warn you, I can smell what's up ahead. And it ain't pretty. Oh, God. Have they eaten everybody? Is that what's been happening? Have they eaten all the, those guys who are chasing us? Yep. Uh, 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 uh. What are we going to do? We could be hundreds of feet underground here. Maybe even thousands. We got Parker's old car. Do you, don't you remember? Does whatever a spite and does whatever a spite. Wow, very can. funny. <laughs> <laughs> now they're in Wyoming. I'm oh, Andy. yes. Wyoming. Wyoming. Uh, hey, guys, well, where are dinosaurs are out people. there. Hunters, dude. They were all the rage a few years back. But expenses, it's expensive to keep, so a lot of them got dumped. We'll be as fine as long as we're wearing that spray I gave you. Electroville. Oh, what the hell is that? If it's a Manhattan skyscraper laying on top of a huge big guy, that'll be the Baxter building. Who's the guy? That Thor's half-brother Loki. Man, you missed yourself one hell of a fight that night. Damn. So somehow the Baxter building got, and Loki got transported to wherever they are. Yeah, how did, who did, how, what nope, did? South Dakota. Always wonder what happened to Reed and Sue. We know what happened to Ben and Johnny, but Reed and Sue are still a mystery. Somebody said Kang beat them up and dumped them in the time stream, but they heard this third hand from the shocker of all people. Maybe they'll come back and save the world. You know, like the old days. Yeah, right. A little late for that, don't you think? Now, this is him referencing how stuff that went on during Mark Millar's at the same time as Fantastic Four run. It was just a little mm -hmm. wink, wink. I see. Oh, man. Red Skull. Ah, uh, no. You know how they've been saying President, Mr. and the President? No. No, not on my Rushmore. Well, he no. didn't wipe them out. Thank God. He, they, uh... Hey, he very well could have and replaced his head. And five red skulls. No thanks. He still shook up, shook up about Ashley. I was the first thing she ever saw, man. The first human being she ever laid eyes on. How much of an honor is that, huh? I helped so many people leave this world. It was so damn cool to watch someone arrive. How the hell did I screw things up so bad? At least you and you seem a little more like your old self. That's what I'm afraid of. What do you mean? You, you know what I mean. Ugh. But I ain't that guy anymore, Hawkeye. I love my life. I love my kids. And I love that little life we've carved out for ourselves. I'm doing this job so we can make our rent. You gotta believe that. I ain't excited by death anymore. Easy, bro. Nobody said you were. Hey, excuse us, ladies. I didn't realize tonight was... Go ahead, Bob. Just try to make a joke. Logan! Damn. What happened, man? What did they do to you? Sit down and I'll tell you. Next super, issue. You find out. Revealed. Finally. Yep. Again, you're just breezing through this. I'm having a little trouble keep up. <laughs> Sorry. Well, it's also that breezy. I know, but you're just but going this, by. This I, make one... a pop... Sorry. I make a reference, though, and you don't laugh. <laughs> Sorry, you're right. You're right. No, Sorry. as soon as it went down, I thought of Land of the Lost because of that. <laughs> you're right. But I got to say, that one was a really short read. Yeah. Okay, come <laughs> on. Where is it? Yep. Internet acting up. I don't. Ah, there we go. So right now Very they're funny. in uh, Doom's Lair. Wow, they made a huge drive then. Yes, they did. Well, they said twelve hours, but geez. Yeah, well, remember last time they were still in the Kingpin's area, but then the rest of that took all going across there. Well, like they said, there was nothing, and given now there's no highways, no traffic. <laughs> yeah, well, they said 12 hours to get from where they, the hammer falls to up to there. Right. That was 12 hours. Oh, my bad. Yeah, then how long did this? Jeez. You want to know what happened? You want to know why I haven't popped my claws in 50 years? It all goes back to the night the villains got their act together, like all our stupid stories. Stress call? 
Yeah, from the Avengers, S.H.I.E.L.D., the Fantastic Four, Wakanda, just about everywhere, Logan. I'm trying to call them back, but all I'm getting is a high-pitched noise. Thoughts? You need to get out of here, Jubilee. Now. Boom! Uh, no, you need to get out of here 20 minutes ago. Oh, no. Jubilee, no. Come on. Oh, yeah. Hello, Wolverine. This is the big one. Oh, but yeah, look, Do uh, Doc Ock, um, Claw, they Hide, Shocker, and Strife. Strife? That Yeah, the guy in the middle. I don't that's, believe I remember that's him. from X-Force. He's Cable's alternate self. Oh, 90s creation? Yep. Ugh. You know how many supervillains there are for every superhero out there? 20, 50? It was only a matter of time before someone organized all that latent talent. Well, what about your egos? <laughs> I know. Quick, hit the evacuation tunnel. Come on, we're done. We've done this like a million times in training. Oh, geez, you see Absorbing Man, Bullseye. I think that's Ultron. Scorpion, Blob, Sober Samurai, Green Goblin, Mr. Sinister. Uh, we got our greatest minds together and worked the whole thing out. The best people on our side for the best people on yours. This is the end, little man. Not on my watch, bub. He just took out um, uh, Sabretooth's head, stabbed Doc Ock and um, Claw. Although Claw's energy, that shouldn't work. They, don't tell but me you stop. What do we care though, dude? This isn't what it seems. Right. Oh, my God. Cyclops St and Storm, where the hell is everybody? No, and, and nobody knows. They've been missing since the alarms went off. What do we do, Wolverine? Just get out of here and don't look back. No matter what you hear, you understand? Don't look back. Oh. Uh. Now you think he's taking out a huge number of them. That should weaken their forces. Yeah. Bullseye was the last to die. We fought for close to 90 minutes, but the bastard just wouldn't go down. All we did was take chunks out of each out of one another. And with his knives in my back, all I could think about what and was go, and what was going down out there. What they'd done to the other superheroes and what he'd do to the kids if I didn't seize my chance. Oh! Logan, Logan, stop. Please, why are you doing this? You're supposed to be our friend. Huh? Oh, dear. Wait, what? What? Did you really think you could do this alone? Take down 40 supervillains, talk about delusions of grandeur, but your friends, people who would hesitate, that's a different matter entirely. My name is Mysterio, Master of Illusion. My thanks on behalf of the criminal community. Magnet Mysterio did this? Tricked him. And we oh. see that Wolverine's never dealt with Mysterio. Yeah, but Mysterio was never that... Yeah, I, forget the fact that he lasted... I forget who he's... I forget who he's working for. Yep, but I just realized. The fact that Jubilee lasted 90 minutes! <sighs> Tough cookie, huh? Yeah. <sighs> You murdered the X-Men, stabbed every one of them, right through their, the heart. But I didn't know it was that Hawkeye. Mysterio made him look and smell, feel, and even smell different. I swear to God, I had no idea. What happened then? Who knows? All I remember was walking through the woods, and the trees, sobbing and crying. Could have been days, could have been weeks. All that sticks in my head was the, the leaves being wet, and the taste of blood in my mouth, and the animals. The animals were so scared of me. I can see that by the sheep. Or the lambs, rather. At Old Vegas, that final showdown between the heroes and the bad guys, it didn't even register. They broke me so bad I couldn't even think. All I wanted was to hurt myself, pay a price for what I'd done. So I waited on a freight train and killed Wolverine dead. Whoa. But a train couldn't kill you. Now was your healing factor. No, but it hurt. And sometimes that's enough. Oh, jeez! Oh, now you're trying. Now, now you and just try telling me Wolverine didn't deserve to die. You just try telling me I've been a fool to hide these claws for fifty years. I wouldn't dare. I'm a farmer now, Hawkeye. These hands don't do nothing except tend the land. So don't even think about asking me to fight again. You hear me? I will never hurt another living soul. 
Your call, brother. 50 cents to cross the river, guys. Pay up or I stick the ants on you. It's a joke. 80 cents or the road ends here, man. I got a million little friends to back me up. All they're waiting on, and all they waiting on is Dwight to give the word. 80 cents and Dwight. Now stay out of trouble, huh? Much obliged, Master Bar Mr. Barton. Have a good one, sir. Is he serious? Oh, Dwight's always serious. Trust me, man. That was 80 cents well spent. Uh, by the way, you're talking too fast. I know this is breezy, but... Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but... I feel so bad for Logan, don't you? Uh, after all that? I, yeah. Like, yeah, I probably take this. I wouldn't even be a farmer. I'd just crawl in a cave and wait for my, wait for my end. Well, Maureen helped him out. Hmm. And that story you told me, man, what happened to you back in Westchester? Well, I'm sorry for making you do this, Logan. If I had known what you've been through, forget about it, bub. The past only hurts if you let it catch up with us. Ah! Yeah. Venom strikes. Probably. Yep. Now, it turns out there's at least one other mutant still alive out there. You're still kind of reading fast, going one character to another. Sorry. <laughs> Are you even take a breath in between? <laughs> Holy burp! What the hell is going on, Logan? I don't know. It's a T-Rex with Venom's face or something. Does it really freaking matter? Oh, man. He must have bonded with one of the Savage Land dinosaurs. All right. We haven't got a chance. We haven't got a chance. Would you shut up and just start blowing holes in him, please? <laughs> Come on. That is awesome, though, isn't it? What, the T-Rex or the guns? The T-Rex. <laughs> Spidey, fight that. Subart, Subart, next Spider-Man movie needs more Venom dinosaurs. <laughs> it's Logan. I'd recognize him anywhere. He's got Hawkeye with him. And Emma? Being... Yep. I recognize the blue lipstick anywhere. <laughs> and they're both being chased by that alien thing that was always annoying Spider-Man. Send Black Bolt. If memory serves, the symbiote was very sensitive to sound. What's going on? Have you knocked it out and knocked it on his ass? I'm blind, you idiot. You tell me. <laughs> uh, you're so damn useless, Hawkeye. Huh? What the hell? Stop. Ah, uh, uh, wow. Black Bolt. Yes, I knew it was Black Bolt, but wow. What God's name? Would somebody mind telling me what just happened here? Oh, a simple word. Just one simple word. I don't hear any. Oh. Right. Holy crap. Did we just teleport? Good evening, gentlemen. I hope you forgive Black Bolt's lack of explanation, but he's a man of few words, I'm afraid. My name is Emma Frost, and I bid you welcome to the Forbidden Quarter. Emma? Oh, oh we know who you are, sweet cheeks. We just want to know why you kidnapped us and our $600 automobile. First of all, the Spider-Mobile didn't cost you anything, Hawkeye. You wanted playing cards with the Mandarin 20 years ago. And even then, you were cheating with a plant and an earpiece. Secondly, <laughs> <laughs> secondly, you haven't been kidnapped. You've been rescued. And this car you're so worried about is being repaired by our technicians. Don't bite the hand that feeds you, darling. We're your first good news since you started this adventure. I don't get it. How come you're still so young? I'm the most powerful psychic in the world, Logan. You see what I want you to see. Even this place isn't quite as pretty as it looks. Oh. Makes sense. Where the hell are we, anyway? The last place on Earth where our once great race can live without fear of persecution. We're not the future anymore, didn't you hear? What do you mean? Those theories about us being the next stage in human evolution were simply that, I'm afraid. Just theories. There's 20 of us now. Not a single mutant born in close to 40 years. We were a blip, Logan. Nothing more than a brief genetic anomaly. Oh, uh, boo-hoo. Maybe we'd feel a little more sorry for you if you hadn't sold us down the river. What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. I, I'm a survivor, Hawkeye. Marrying my husband saved a lot of mutant lives. Oh, don't give me that. You had Black Bolt on your side. Uh, and, and, and they had Loki and Dormammu and Magneto. Need I continue? We simply forged a pact in the interests of our species. Whatever. You, if, it's still in you, isn't it? This superhero thing. Deep down, 
You haven't changed at all. I know what's in the box, Hawkeye. Well, let's just hope you can still keep a secret, skank. Oof. I gotta say, uh, Emma's face here is weird. <laughs> but if it's her psychic projection, it might explain it. <laughs> uh, the French brilliance. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, that's the buggy oper and that's the buggy operational again, Miss Frost. We fixed her up as clean as a whistle. Excellent. Now be good boys and show our visitors to the eastern exit, would you? Whatever you say, Miss Frost. Well, Logan, did you find that piece you always crave? Huh? This life you built for yourself in California. Are you happy with your wife and children? Did you finally find contentment? You're the mind reader. Then congratulations. <laughs> Doom. Doom. Oh, her husband! No. She married Doom. Oh, why? <laughs> to, to keep the mutants safe. Oh, what was she talking I, I, about? Uh, uh, I know, I know. Doom's a man of his words sometimes, but just ugh. yeah. They're in Ohio now. Um, what was she talking about back there, Hawkeye? What are you carrying in that case? Mind your own business. It isn't drugs. I said, mind your own business, Logan. Pim Falls, Connecticut. Uh, what happened to my own state? What happened? <laughs> only twenty minutes from Pim Falls now, bub. That's the entrance to New Babylon, right? I wonder why they called it Pim Falls. Keep your eyes on the road, man. You'll find out soon enough. Yeah. Oh. Well, poor giant. It even wipes through his head, too. What? Look. The road was uh, next to his Oh. 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 What yeah, was the one, road, one road goes that way, the other one goes upward. Did they just get, go into a writing room and uh, go to the storyboard room and say, that's like, that's the most gruesome thing possible? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this place. New Babylon, man, where anything can happen. And there's, look, there's the Red Skull. Can I be frank with you, Logan? This trip we just made, it wasn't what you think. That drug grinding thing was just a cover story, dude. What? You better not be ripping me off here, bub. I go back home without that cash, and the Hulk gang's eating my kids for breakfast. Relax, short stuff. I'm an ex-superhero. And an ex and an ex super villain. Would you shut up? You'll get your cash. These guys we're meeting got money to burn. I just wanted to give you a heads up before we make contact. I thought you'd be glad I wasn't running drugs this time. I am glad. So smile for perp's sake. Hey, anybody seen the fat man around here? Hawkeye. Okay. I'm so pleased to see you, friend. We heard you got killed back in Utah, man. We thought we you'd never make it. Eh, it was nothing we couldn't handle, Tobias. We've got blown off course for a couple of days, but the merchandise is as safe as, as houses. If, uh, you mind if we take a look? Be my guest. 99 vials of super soldier serum for 99 members of your rebel alliance. What? Tobias is the front man for a super t team being put together, and my contacts on the West Coast are only too pleased to lend a hand. It's beautiful, Hawkeye. This is all we needed. Uh, the villains are dead or divided or fat. This is all we need to start the next Avengers team. Well, I'm afraid there's still one, some tiny little small print you and I haven't spoken about, Tobias. No problem. How much do you need? Oh, it's not money. Not for me, anyway. All I'm after is a cast iron assurance. Which is? A place on the superhero team and a vial of the super serum. Is this a joke? The Red Skull killed my friends, dude. When they're and when they're going down, I want a piece of them. You understand? Now either count me in or the deal's off. Once an Avenger, always an Avenger, huh? It's a de deal, old man. You've got your place on the team. Awesome. You have no idea how much of this means to me. I feel like I felt when I when they first made me an Avenger, just to have someone believe in me like this. Hawkeye. Oh. Uh. What the hell? Down, boy. Ugh! It's a it's a betrayal. Ah, oh, you snakes. Undercover shield agents. You just ride straight into a sting, Hawkeye. There's no super team. There is no rebel alliance. You really think the president wouldn't know every conversation that goes down in this town? What do you want me to do? Beg? You think because I'm old and blind, I'm going to give you that satisfaction? Do your do your worst. 
Oh no. Okay. Ugh. And there goes Hawkeye. Christ. So this whole trip was for nothing. This is starting to get too bleak. <laughs> well, we're almost done. Come on. No, that's not it. Part seven for last one. Oh, there, there's the cover. Ah. Yep. This is like a this is a horror movie. This is what it is. What are you whispering, Captain? Is that a prayer? Well, there's no God here today. Just me. Like I said, that's Bucky Camp. Every time I see him, I'm thinking the video game. <laughs> <laughs> but those teeth of his. Why yeah. didn't we think of this years ago, eh? Knew I knew you couldn't beat us if we if I ever got them organized. Do you know what's coming next? We're going to carve up your beloved country among all of our chief lieutenants. The Abomination wants California. Doom wants the Bible Belt. And Meet Magneto wants Las Vegas for some godforsaken reason. Guess who gets the White House? And as for the rest of the world, well, who'd want it now, eh? So don't get up. It'll be all over soon. No, it's shh, don't get up. Now, 50 years since then. Even now, I'd beat you. Even as an old man, I'm still strong. My wife thinks I'm morbid, Hans, but I consider his uniform the most glorious of all our prizes. The ancients wore the skins of their fallen foes. Why shouldn't I be allowed my eccentricities? Tobias and the shield team have those corpses you requested, Air Skull. Should I tell them you're unavailable? Just send them in. So this is the superhero serum that had everyone so excited. All that trouble over one little box. You have to understand, sir. Captain America rising from the dead is a very potent myth for Americans. Well, he's not coming back this time, Tobias. Wait, all, and are all these things for real? Oh, yes. This is my trophy room. This is where I come when I need to make decisions. What better place for inspiration than here among the corpses of my enemy? I still can't believe you got, uh, you've got you got Hawkeye in there. Uh, I know. I never really rated him either. But credit where it's due. It would have seemed curlish now not to stack him with the Parker and the Starks. How many others are, are out there, Tobias? How many others would be would be heroes holding meetings in their basement? Nothing we can't hear, Andal, Air Skrull, and Skull. Well done, uh, and you've done well, my friend. This money you were using to flush them out, I want you to have, keep it and have some fun. Sir, there's something wrong with the accomplice. Of course there is. You riddled him with bullets. No, his wounds are disappearing. He's... Uh, <laughs> oh, you're going down, Scrawl. Well, this is an unexpected surprise. I thought you walked the path of the righteous men these days, Wolverine. Is this because we killed your little friend? Oh! Uh. Like the skull said, he's still strong. Uh. Look at you. You're not just out of shape. You won't even pop your adamantium claws anymore. Oh, what did we and what did we do, uh, do to you, Wolverine? You're pathetic. Automatic locks. And what, and what the hell? You should have stayed in whatever hole you crawled into, little Arkhikreshker. At least that way you could have died in your bed. Ooh! No. Oh. Stay down, you son of a bitch. Don't make me laugh. You haven't got the guts. Now this is a moment like when Steve had this to Tony during Civil War. Oh. Only there, Steve hesitated. Wolverine. Uh, yeah, yeah, I expected that. Everybody back. We need to blow the doors. And can't let the kids down. Can't let the kids down. Gotta find and gotta find something to fight them with. Hmm. Mr. <laughs> Brother, what's going on? Are you okay, sir? Oh no. Oh yeah. Oh no no. Oh no. Oh yeah. <laughs> reckon I, I reckon I need this dough more than you do, Tobias. Code red, code red, emergency at the White House, boys. All units must attend. Suit to voice control. Avengers cleared code Bravo 240. And full speed back to California. 
300 miles from, 3,000 miles from home. 2,000 miles from home. Of course, the armor will get him there. <laughs> 1,000 miles from home. 500 miles from Sacramento. Fuel rods are running low, are running low, sir. Recharge required. Ignore it. Just go faster. Fuel rods are empty. Just keep going. Advise emergency landing. Just keep going, computer. I will not let my family down. You understand? What the hell? <laughs> what do you think it is? It's, and Silas, is it human? Well, underneath the shell it is. And a mighty fine shell it is, too. Looks like a grade A chromium from here. And he seems to be clutching some kind of case. Silas! Ugh. Get the hell away from me! This money's for my family, you get me? I will not be stopped when I've come this far. 36 hours later. Mm hmm? Donovan, thank God. Old man Donovan. Hey, are you a Cypressor's eyes? Tell him I got it. Tell Marine I got the money, and we don't have to worry about the Hulk gang no more. Oh, Logan. What's wrong? Where's my wife and kid? Kids, what the hell's going on here, Donovan? The Hulk gang already been here for their money. What are you talking about? We've got two more weeks. He said they got bored. No. Now, don't you go doing something stupid. They'll only take it out on the rest of us. And you ain't the man you used to be, Logan. You can, you can honor your family by grieving and giving those kids a good Christian burial. You know we're always here for you, Logan. But you got to promise us you will not go looking for revenge in those hills. You understand? Logan, the name isn't Logan, bub. Snake! Ah, uh, he's back. It's Wolverine. He's back. Yep. And here is the final one. Old Man Logan, giant size. Yeah, but I'm really getting depressed. I mean, that was all for nothing. It was, but the Hulk gang is going down. Sure he is, but I've nothing to show for it. Oh, look at that cover. Whoa. Actually, I know. They actually, just wrecked the ground apart. <laughs> actually, he's coming right out of a tunnel. But uh, uh, yeah. I'm t I'm still ticked off Pappy Bammer and wouldn't let us eat those kids. They look delicious. It wasn't snack time, Rufus. Pappy took us there to send that old fool Logan a message. And his wife's dead body wouldn't have been enough. Little redheads t and taste like bacon. And would he? The least he could have done is let us eat one. Would you shut up and clean your damn bloody stains? And Boo and Luke and got the video working. And Billy Bob found two Jim Belushi movies. There's one where he's a cop and his partner's a dog. Looks pretty damn hilarious. Shroom! I thought that was Chuck Norris. Shroom! <laughs> <laughs> Rufus? Oh, hell, you don't need the salt just because I was yelling no. at you. Rufus? Oh! Over in ain't playing. Nope. Over in don't play that. <laughs> oh, Elrod, sometimes I just, and sometimes I just can't believe what a R and retard you are, little cousin. And stealing their Game Boy, I can understand. But what the hell kind of pleasure does a grown man get from a little girl's doll? I, I like Raggedy Ann. She's pretty. Have a sniff at her face. It used this. You can still smell the baby milk. Oh, man, this is too messed up even for me. Give me five more beers, old man. My boys and I are out celebrating a job well done. Whatever you say, Mr. Luke. Just don't cause any trouble. Oh, come on, come on dude. Is this the phase that's going to start trouble? Yes. Yes you, yes, you look like the Joker mixed with the gang Green Gang from the Powerpuff Girls. And the Goblin. Uh, yeah, yeah, you almost forgot the Green Goblin. <laughs> what the hell? What's going on? Get out of my way, you little thou. Somebody find the flashlight. Luke, is that you? Oh, God almighty. Yeah. Well, um, Hef's mansion, Hef. <laughs> oh, no. Well, ma'am, what, well, ma what could I say? Thank you kindly for your hospitality. <laughs> and, and be sure to thank the ladies once they all regain consciousness. My pleasure, Bo. Just be sure to tell your pappy what a good time you boys had, and maybe he'll knock a little off our rent this month. In this month, what and what was you out celebrating anyway? Trust me, sweet cheeks, you don't want to know. Oh, look at that! Uh oh. Try me. You think he's got? And uh, you think he's gonna come here, pappy? 
even though there's and so many of us, you think he's going to come here looking for revenge? We killed his wife and children, Bo and Bobby Joe. Laid them out like they were a damn finger buffet. You bet your ass he's coming here. Sweet Jesus! Yeah, all of these are the banner kids. Jeez. Nothing but a bunch of hillbilly trailers. Oh, flying through with the four car. That's one way God, to take out trailer park these trash. <laughs> God, I miss these fights. What the hell? It's Bo. What's he got in his mouth? Beep. Beep. Up. Ah, oh, furp. <laughs> Ah, oh, sh no more talking. I'm just here to kill you people. Opium, Bobby uh, Joe jumped in and she dead. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh. Banner, get out here and face me, you coward. Would you be quiet? You're going to wake the baby. <laughs> what? Huh? Just like old times, huh, Wolverine? been years since I had something good to smash. A lot of folks say that I went mad, that the radiation sickness did something to my brain. But who else was I going to mate with besides my first cousin? Jenny she was the only woman who could take the, the damn pace. Ah! I told my boys we had to make an example of you. But the honest truth was, I wanted my old Wolverine back. I got bored being a landlord. Bored of being a supervillain. I need someone cool to kill to make me feel alive again. Poor cat. Poor Bessie. Shut up! Oh, uh, hamburgers, anybody? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't a joke. This isn't another one of those st stupid fights. This is where it ends, you redneck son of a bitch. That's for my wife and kids. You idiot. You should have made me angry, Logan. People piss themselves when I get angry. Oh. And he eats Wolverine. Ah. Oh. Happy Banner, you hear, sir? It's your grandson, Billy Bob. You remember Bo's oldest boy? I went to meet and to my friends to fetch those Jim Belushi movies. And when I got back, the whole crew was dead. Did Wolverine really do this? Did one man really kill our entire family? Daddy he did, Billy Bob. But, and, but I fought him and beat him and made him my supper. He isn't going to be hurting us anymore. But, but he's wiped us all out, Pappy. As far as I can see, the Hulk gang's just you and me now. Plus little baby Bruce and uh, Bruce and plus little baby Bruce. Don't forget my little favorite now, Billy Bob. But you and me are all we need to keep this thing going, son. Once we grab ourselves some women from Hep's old place, we could start the whole thing over. My superpower surviving, boy. Don't you get it? The atomic blast, the rise of the supervillains, staying alive in a world without hope. You okay, Pappy? You don't look so good. I'm fine. Just this weird cramp the last couple of hours, and Jesus, my gut! Hey, wait a minute. Did you say you ate Wolverine? Yeah, no big deal. We've been snacking our own foes for years, Billy Bob. But none of them had healing factors. Ugh. You gotta be kidding me, you little runt! Ah, uh, nope. Oh. Oh. What the hell? Oh. What's the matter, Banner? Banner, something you ate? Oh. <laughs> pants and pants. Boots and coat. Hand them over. They might live a little longer. Whatever you say, Wolverine. Just don't hurt me and stay away from baby Bruce. What makes you think I'm going to leave the baby? The Hulk robbed me of my family. Only fair I should take away his. Oh. Aw. Everybody loved Maureen and those kids. They were beautiful, Logan. The best. It's good to hear they're in you got their little toys back, too, huh? It's something. You sure you're ready to walk away and leave all this behind? All I got here are memories, Abe, and I can take those wherever I go. My wife and babies don't live here no more. You re and you're really going out to take them down, Mr. Logan? You're really going to bring the law back to this country? Why not? Got nothing better to do. You realize it's impossible. Friend told me there's no such word. And who might that be? The same man who taught me to forgive myself. Besides... I got a little partner to help me out, and there's a nice poetic justice to Bruce Banner Jr. being the first guy on my new team. You comfy there, little buddy? Things have changed, you silly old fool. This ain't a world for super teams and big grand plans. All you're going to do is get yourselves killed. Oh, yeah? Well, they killed me 50 years ago, bub, and I got better. 
I figured I've kept my head down long enough. Well. Maybe I shouldn't have eaten, to eaten before I looked at this. <laughs> but overall, yes, what that, did you think? Because that was nauseating. Because that was, like I said, Robert, you're not okay, giving well, it away. Okay, for the, oh, yeah, but for the overall story, from a story standpoint. Dude, it was depressing. Well, it it's was. Tell you. It feels like one of those gritty westerns, though, doesn't it? Yeah, but the gritty westerns I watched all have some semblance of... Some of know, them, except for the one where the main guy dies. Well, Clint Eastwood didn't die in the one I watched, so... <laughs> True, but there have been ones where the hero has died. But in this case, he didn't. But this, talk about a twisted world that they actually would bring back later on. It would be called the Wasteland. Proper name, given the, the, the whole Mad Max feeling of it all. Yeah, we would have Old Man Quill, Peter Quill from Guardians of the Galaxy. We'd have a prequel to this, Old Man Hawkeye. We would have Old Man Logan, and then eventually he would die. And then we would have the Wasteland Avengers, where we find where it wraps everything up. That's time you invite me to one of these, we're choosing a lighter book. <laughs> right, right. But yeah, back uh, again, if I wanted this much violence, I would have played Mad World. <laughs> right, but the violence side, the artwork was still damn good, wasn't it? I don't know. Kind of reminded me of the book, the artwork from the War Ultimate Warrior comic. Really? Like, uh, although maybe not as bad. Nowhere near as bad. But Steve McNiven is a good artist, and the way he was able to capture all the characters were good, and some of the redesigns were interesting. Dang, interesting, but ugly. Oh, uh, yeah. Ugly. This spider bitch. <sighs> but yeah, this was a depressing story. But at least we'll bring guys revenge. And at least there's a sign of hope that he could try and bring back peace to the to the wastelands. <sighs> and we do know in a different story that Bruce, uh, Bruce uh, Jr., he actually does grow up to be a Hulk, a proper Hulk hero. Oh, yeah. So again, there there is showing that there is good that's going to happen. Then only in the end, Jim and Nets. Yeah, but although, and once again, you talked, to, you kept talking too fast. I told you, I asked you three times to read it slower. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It just like yeah, well, it kind of ruined the pace. It kind of ruined the pacing. <laughs> it's fast enough as it is. Right, but I kind of got in the mood of just going by, you know, reading it that you know, like boom, boom, boom. Yeah, but. but yeah, like, you, take this, dude. You don't have to rush because of me, right? I guess. What did you see about the idea of the villains uniting like that? What do you think about it? I can't take again, not realistic. It would not good. Their egos would clash too much. Oh, that's very true. But if it happened, when you see about it, there's so many more villains to per hero, they go shrill. But a lot of those heroes are gods, don't forget that. <laughs> true, but when you have some gods on your side, like Loki. Yeah, okay, when you got that is when you got all the mega level you mutants on your side, and a True. Hulk, and that's uh, why they use, that's why they did the plan with Wolverine. I gotta say, Mysterio manipulating Wolverine again. It's like that's never happened for good reason. He had to uh, Logan would kill him. Well, yeah, which he did. Yeah. Afterwards, and uh, Spidey would have to whip the uh, take. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I got this. I got this one. Hey, Spider Bub. Oh well, <laughs> yeah, but. Again, the idea is throwing different villains. Now, that was something they did way back during Acts of Vengeance years ago in the 80s, where they decided, let's swap villains with some of the heroes. Huh. That's, that the one where, that's the one where uh, Magneto joined up while the Red Skull was on his team, but he did it with the intent on putting the Red Skull in his place. Obviously, he's like a survivor. <laughs> yeah. But uh, wait, was this the one where uh, Spidey fought uh, the Juggernaut? No. That was no, a separate that was a story. story. This is the one where it's during this fight it went cosmic. Uh, oh, ooh. yeah. The same I want, time. I you, cosmic you should you should have shown me that one. <laughs> I don't have that on me at the moment. Ah, crud. Because I know you love cosmic Spidey. Oh, I do. But that could be another one. But this one overall, though, I would just say it's a good romp. I mean, it's disgusting. It gets depressing. But yeah. Again, it's Mark Millar at that point with the, the peak of his shock. His, his, yeah, shock value books. I'll say. But the the, see, the story for Wolverine would be that he reached a point where he had no choice but to pop the claws out again. And now, instead of sitting on his ass, he's going to bring back, try and go back and bring justice back to the world. At least, think, at least he and uh, Hawkeye had some good banter going. <laughs> oh, definitely. And at least Emma's still good out there. True. 
And believe it or not, it's actually Doom who takes out the other warlords in the Wasteland Avengers. Ah. And then dies of cancer. Ugh. But he at least died bringing down, bringing down, bringing order to everything. Never let it be said that Doom, despite all of that, uh, being a baddie, doesn't stay true to his word. <laughs> exactly. But Ultron 8 was... And who, who did Peter um, knock I have no I, have... I, I don't know. I mean, she, he and Glory Grant were never a thing. thing. Mystery woman? <laughs> who knows? Who knows? They never said who the mom was. Yeah. But, but poor Hawkeye. He went in with a lot of hope and ended up being a sting operation. Ugh. <sighs> The fact that he should have thought that coming, but he was so blinded by wanting to do good and overthrowing Red Skull. But in the end... Being blind, being blind anyway. <laughs> well, yeah. But in the end, Wolverine did it for him. Yeah. Too bad he wasn't around to see it. Both ways. <laughs> yeah. You just said it. You just said being blind. Uh, just as is blind, just as whatever. But and if you were to rate this one to ten for story and artwork separately... Uh... I don't know. I kind of got. I kind of went in expecting something else. <laughs> oh, what were you no, expecting? Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of hard to describe. Well, it's hard Mad to put Max, into words. It's hard to put into words. You'd have to go into my mind and visualize it. Mad Max me. went the same way though. Hey, guys. Yeah, but His family Mad got Mad killed Mad. and he went and got revenge. Uh, take this. No, at the original, yes, but it had sequels that were. Well, yeah, awesome. but the original. Yeah, it, it was a lot. Of, hey, I don't know what it is about Mad Max. Maybe it's because I'm seeing it on the big screen or something. And it had a lot more style to it. <clears throat> it had a lot more style to it. Here, it's nothing but desert. Well, yeah. But... Desert, but it made the desert really feel like it's, you know, a post-apocalyptic something or other. Well, yeah. That, well, the first one didn't, remember. The first one actually had grass. True. I don't know. It just had more to it, especially in the Road Warrior and Battle Dome. Yeah, I always feel like or Thunderdome, first, Thunderdome. Thunderdome. I always feel like the first Mad Max is what really happened, and it's kind of like El, um, El Mariachi. The first one's what really happened, and each one's a retelling as it gets bigger in the legend. Really? Yeah, that's hmm. how I look at it. Like it's his adventures, because you know they get bigger and more grandiose to the point of absurdity. Yeah, but if, at least the Road Warrior gave us the Ayatollah of Rock and Roll as Chris yeah, Jericho. Oh yeah, but that, 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 that name right there. Yeah, but it, hey, it worked for wrestling because not only did Chris Jericho say he was the Ayatollah of Rock and Roll, it gave us the tag team, the Road Warriors. That's true. <laughs> but, we can, but yeah, but overall, I mean, Old Man Logan clearly has its place. Um, I give it a seven. A solid right. seven. For the hey, story seven. Is... You know, seven claws out of ten. <laughs> so... so... Is that for just the story, the artwork, or both? Uh, overall. Overall? All right. Me, I would give it an eight. Uh, an eight? It's not my all-time favorite Wolverine story, but... Well, no. It what has is? its place. That's why I say it has its place. It's an uh, What is your favorite Wolverine story? Ooh, that would have to be probably Enemy of the State for a good adventure romp. Oh. Uh, uh, well, what about anything else? So uh, what are the um, ones well, Wolverine and Origins, the whole Wolverine origin story. Hmm. That we actually had, it's an adventure that eventually brings him down, the man who was responsible for so much of it, Romulus. Right. Uh, no, you've told me about that. But that's a big one to go over. <laughs> I'd have to do multi, multi parts for Yeah, that. yeah, that, that would be a multi part video for sure. Much like Cable and uh, Deadpool. Yeah, Deadpool! Yeah. Yep. Well, thank you, thank you for joining me, Eric. Thanks everyone else here, and we'll see you all in the next one. Take care. Hasta la vista.